fantastic. Well, thank you, Jacqueline. And uh, yeah, I think the uh, the best place to start is really in introducing our judges. And we're incredible to incredibly thankful for the judges who have dedicated an immense amount of time to being part of the program today, not only in terms of the preparation, but also in terms of uh, really just ensuring that uh, the program had the, the kind of resonance it did with so many people around the world. And that really is attributed to the folks who are online today and uh, participating with us as a part of the audience. And so first of all, and I want to um, uh, introduce uh, Nicole Cober. She's the principal managing partner at Cober, Johnson and Romney. Uh, and she's gonna be uh, judging as well as Nathan Sunheimer who's the head of corporate innovation at Plug and Play. Uh, Nathan has been around digital health and innovation for uh, a long time. And the, the folks at Plug and Play in Silicon Valley uh, are, are one of the leading global institutions in this area of uh, digital healthcare. Uh, and then finally, Blair Hurst, who's the, the CEO and the founder of the Digital Health Review, a publication that really helps people understand and sense make about what is going on in digital health uh, here today. And with that, I'd also like the judges to introduce themselves and take uh, a minute or two to, uh, to give, uh, again, just uh, a little bit of a background on, on uh, who they are, where they come from, and their interest in digital. Uh, so we'll start with Nicole. Nicole? Good afternoon, everyone. I apologize. <laughs> yes. Apologize in advance for um, the frog in my throat getting over a little cold, but uh, my name is Nicole Cobert. I'm the principal managing partner of Cobert Johnson and Romney. We are a consulting and legal strategy firm based in Washington D.C. I have been an entrepreneur, entrepreneurial soul for nearly two decades, over two decades, excuse me. Um, I have trained and facilitated uh, starting and scaling businesses um, around the country, specifically um, based out of the DMV area. <clears throat> more than 200 uh, companies. Uh, I've helped with their management, communication, and legal um, strategy for scaling. Um, recently, I, I'm a former uh, SCORE mentor for the SBA. I also um, was a trainer for uh, SBA's Emerging Leaders Program, which is a, a robust a, a accelerator, <clears throat> a nationally recognized accelerator around the country. And so my heartbeat is truly um, giving the resources to small businesses to not only survive, thrive, but scale uh, their operations so that they can really support the economic uh, communities that they are housed in. And I'm very, very grateful to be here with you all today. No, and we're grateful for you joining us today. Thank you very much, uh, Nicole, for joining us. And, and next up, we have uh, Nathan. Nathan, uh, again, thank you for joining us here today. And really great to have Plug and Play be a part of this. Um, uh, for those of you who aren't familiar with Plug and Play, please, please Google them and, and learn more about them. They've been around for the better part of the past decade, really leading a lot of the digital health innovations that have taken place. They're based out of Silicon Valley, but they're all over the world. Nathan, uh, a little bit about yourself and Plug and Play. And, uh, thank you so much for the introduction, Stan, and uh, thank you all for having me here today. Uh, as Stan mentioned, hi everyone, my name is Nathan Sunheimer and I lead U.S. Healthcare Partnerships and co-lead our Digital Health Accelerator here at Plug and Play. Uh, for those who are not familiar with Plug and Play, in a nutshell, we are a global innovation platform where we connect the world's best startups with over 500 of our national and global partners across 18 different industries to bring technologies and uh, solutions to market faster. Um, outside of plug and play, I devote my time to the innovation ecosystem by volunteering my time as a mentor for startups uh, and also serving um, my time or serving as a mentor with other accelerators who support innovators that are constantly pushing the envelope uh, to improve the status quo of healthcare. Uh, to name a few, it's Accelerate Health in Louisville. We have G Beta MedTech and uh, KidsX. But um, ultimately, thank you so much for having me here today. I'm extremely excited to be here with Nicole and Blair and see the pitches from the fantastic seven startups that are tackling social isolation that HitLab has lined up for us today. So uh, thanks, Dan. All 
right. Outstanding. All right. And, and Blair Hurst review as well. Really excited to hear about this. Hi, thanks, Dan. Uh, I'm Blair Hurst, founder of Digital Health Review. And uh, our platform is really tackling health equity, equity through technology. So we onboard digital health companies like the many that we have here at today's uh, challenge. Um, and our goal is to work with them to first get consumer outreach, but also to build better tech. So we're working to help connect to academic and research institutions for that clinical validation, if you don't have that yet, um, as well as working with any other regulatory bodies to get HIPAA compliance um, and outreach to provider networks that are, are key to uh, reaching patients. So um, we really believe in the value of digital health, the value of uh, digital health equalizing the opportunities around healthcare for all. Um, I'm very excited to hear uh, the pitches today um, and to see what's coming next. Uh, so thank you, Stan, for that introduction. No, it's great to, to have you on board. And again, uh, congratulations on Digital Health Review and just all the good success going on there as well.